Joseph Javorsky, noted scientist, recently escaped from behind the Iron Curtain, wife and children killed in Hungary. His aide carries a briefcase, secret data on the Russian moonshot. Joseph Javorsky's destination, Yucca Flats, and a meeting with top brass at the A-bomb testing ground. These men are also from behind the Iron Curtain. Two of the Kremlin's most ruthless agents. Their orders, get the briefcase, kill Javorsky. Mr. Javorski, get in the car. Flag on the moon. How did it get there? Secret data. Pictures of the moon. Secret data. Never before outside the Kremlin. Man's first rocket to the moon.
Yucca Flats, the A-bomb. Vacation time, man and wife, unaware of scientific progress. Joseph Javorsky, noted scientist, dedicated his life to the betterment of mankind. Young Joe Dobson, desert patrolman.
Officer. Yeah? There's a man dead. Back down the road. Dead? How far down? A couple miles. Maybe more. Laying behind his car. Looks like he's been choked. Joe Dobson, caught in the wheels of progress. Man choked to death, a woman's purse, and footprints on the wasteland. Touch a button, things happen. A scientist becomes a beast. Be down in a minute, Joe. Yeah. Better come with me. Trouble up the road. Murder. Be right down. See you later, honey. Jim Archer, Joe's partner. Another man caught in a frantic race for the betterment of mankind. Progress. Jim Archer. Wounded parachuting on Korea. Jim and Joe try to keep the desert road safe for travelers. Seven days a week.
shock waves of an A-bomb, a once powerful, humble man, reduced to nothing. Joseph Javorsky, respected scientist, now a fiend, prowling the wastelands, a prehistoric beast in the nuclear age. Kill. Kill just to be killing. Mouth of the cave, 1,000 feet up, over jagged cliffs. A man murdered, a woman's purse. Jim and Joe picked their way upward to the mouth of the cave. One slip and a thousand feet to nowhere. the owner of the purse. Yeah. Let's take her down. May still be alive. Hey, she's still breathing. Cover with her arm, Joe. Feel her pulse. Well, doctors can't help her. Maybe angels, but not doctors. Vacation time. People travel east, west, north or south. The Radcliffs travel east with two small boys, adventurous boys. Nothing bothers some people, not even flying saucers.
Come on, Art. Let's get some soda pop. Uh, hey, hey, mister. Uh, do you mind if we bother you a minute? Boys from the city, not yet caught in the whirlwind of progress, feed soda pop to the thirsty pigs. Coyotes, once a menace to travelers. Missile bases run them off their hunting grounds. How much do I owe you? Three dollars. Boys, we're leaving. Mom, we saw some real pigs. Yeah, and a coyote. Coyote? Yeah. Don't you be playing with coyotes. Now, come on. We're leaving. Come on. Oh, we never get to have any fun. Ten in the shade, and no shade. Jim and Joe try to make their way up to the plateau. To reach the top, a man needs an airplane. A jump from a plane could land you on top. Killers, not on the plateau. Hours in the brawling hot desert sun, with no trace of the killer. To put Jim Archer's paratroop training to good use is the only answer. A trip up into the skies and jump. And if the killer is on the plateau, kill him. Shoot first. Ask questions later.
I can't find them. What do you think we should do? I don't know, Lois. Stay here, I'll go out farther. We'll find them. on the prowl, looking for something or somebody to kill, quench the killer's thirst.
shoot first, ask questions later. Pilot dropped his man. If Joe Dobson moves north, Hank will be caught in the middle. An innocent victim caught in the wheels of justice. Somebody shoots at him. Jim Archer, ex-paratrooper, trained to hunt down his man and destroy him. Hunter and the hunted. With only a few hundred yards between him and the enemy, Jim closes in for the kill. Explain, Lois. Stay here. The boys may come back. I gotta get help. Joe Dobson headed north and met Jim. Twenty hours without rest and still no enemy. In the blistering desert heat, Jim and Joe plan another attack. Find the beast and kill him. Kill or be killed. Man's inhumanity to man.
Randy, you think we're lost? Maybe. I don't know, Art. Maybe. Let's go. water down there? I sure hope so. My throat's dry. Mine too. up here? Don't talk about it. Come on. Finding his victim gone, unleashes his fury.
Hank and some helpful neighbors. The search narrows. Jim, you all right? Joseph Javorsky, noted scientist.